You know, those eerie red eyes that sometimes show up in flash photos? Well, if they don't show up in photos of your young children, that could be a sign of a serious health problem. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez explains. It's happened to every parent. You take a very cute picture of your baby and it comes out looking like something out of a bad horror movie. The red eye is the flash bouncing off the blood vessels in the retina at the back of the eye. But if you see something other than red... Well, if there's something blocking that or something abnormal with the eye or the eye is off-center, it can give a wider yellowish reflex. That's what Mackenzie and Madison Foreman's parents noticed one day. Mackenzie's eyes were different than her twin sisters. It was Memorial Day weekend... Uh, uh, 2011. We just happened to have her in a little bouncy chair uh, laying in the living room. When I went to pick her up, I just noticed in her eye um, just kind of a hollowness. That hollowness can indicate several medical conditions, from a cataract to a detached retina. In rare cases, it can mean cancer, called retinoblastoma. It can spread outside the eye and can be fatal if it's not picked up soon enough. Mackenzie had a tumor in her left eye. Just six months old, she began chemotherapy, and doctors eventually removed her eye. And when the foremans looked back through Mackenzie's baby photos, they realized her left pupil showed up white for some time. They wonder, had they known what this picture could indicate, would their daughter have both eyes today? Definitely, we need to make parents aware. Retinoblastoma is rare. Cataracts are a little more common, but both need to be found and treated early. That's why taking a good look at your child's photos is a good idea. If you suspect anything, point it out to your pediatrician. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News. Wow, well, Dr. Max says some flash cameras cause eye pupils to close down to minimize red eyes, so look for a white or yellowish color in the eyes. Excellent information. Mm -hmm. That's going to do it for us here at 5. We'll see you again at 11. The News at 6 starts right now.